And finally, new rule. Now that Governor Jerry Brown of California is signing separate climate treaties with China in defiance of our federal government. Conservatives... <laughs> Conservatives can't complain. They can't complain when our local law enforcement refuses to cooperate with Trump's deportation squad. They... <laughs> They can't grouse about California cities threatening to deny contracts to any firm that hel helps build the border wall. They... They can't get mad because we're just following in a long and hallowed conservative tradition called states' rights. It's just that now we're the state that wants to be left alone. Mississippi didn't like what Attorney General Bobby Kennedy was doing in the 60s. Well, I don't like what Jeff Sessions is doing now. Yeah. The, uh, the script has completely flipped from 50 years ago when progressives ran the show in Washington and it was Alabama Governor George Wallace who physically blocked the door of the University of Alabama to prevent black kids from enrolling. He was always screaming about states' rights, which he used as justification for this. Segregation now, segregation tomorrow, and segregation forever. But that was then. Now, the white supremacists are the federal government. <laughs> and it's liberal states that are under siege from federal overreach. We're trying to defend our way of life here and what we believe in. We believe in sanctuary cities and pollution controls. <laughs> and legalized pot and gun control and Obamacare and a woman's right to choose. And we're going to defend them. We the rebel now. <laughs> We are the rebels now, and now we get to talk like this. <laughs> Let me tell you something. We don't much cotton when federal government thinks it knows better how to do things than we do here in our own state. <laughs> the mud flaps on my electric car say coexist. <laughs> We don't need no outside agitators <laughs> with their Make America Great Again caps coming in here to our clean state and telling us to take down our solar panels <laughs> or how to treat our interns. <laughs> here in our state, we use tiki torches the way they're supposed to be used for lesbian weddings on the beach. <laughs> Farm to table ain't just words around here. <laughs> That's our heritage. <laughs> we, we pride there ain't no pesticides in our organic broccolini. <laughs> we pride of gay sex and hot yoga. We pride of pioneering colonic irrigation. <laughs> You can have my Botox injection when you pry it from my cold, dead hands. <laughs> vaginal rejuvenation today, vaginal rejuvenation tomorrow, vaginal rejuvenation forever. <laughs> you know, that meddling federal government in Washington even wants to tell us who we can marry and where we can pee. They want to come in here and segregate our restrooms, telling us who can pee where. <laughs> well, my daddy was transgender, and his daddy before him, <laughs> and his daddy before him. <laughs> here in L.A. County, we wear our ball gowns over our balls, if we choose. <laughs> one, one more thing. They got them an attorney general up there in Washington by the name of Jeff Sessions. 
And he said, and I quote, good people don't smoke marijuana. <laughs> well, there are good people here, Mr. Attorney General, and sometimes we just want to sit on our porch and watch all grass grow. <laughs> 